Okay, we are broadcasting live. This is the official Life is Beautiful pool party at the Downtown Grand Hotel in Las Vegas. My name is Casey McCabe with 97.1 Amp Radio and Radio.com. And today, a very special guest poolside, Billie Eilish. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. She is in the house. You have been, you have been making the rounds on uh, the festival circuits. Yes. Um, what's like surprised you from performing at all the festivals? Surprised me? Yeah. Um... Uh, I feel like I don't know if this is something that surprised me, but it's just something that I've I've felt a lot, and I didn't know that I would notice. But um, when you are on stage, you can literally see everyone, and they don't realize it. So like they'll be looking at you like giving you the dirty like, look during it, and uh-huh. they don't know that you're like watching these bitches. Like <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because I mean I used to be in the crowd all the time growing up. I'd go to so many shows, and I was always you know I wasn't you're not conscious of. <laughs> The facial expression that you got, but but do you acknowledge them back and let them know that they are making that I face do and sometimes. make something back? I do. And then what kind of face do they make? They get really freaked out. <laughs> they get scared. They get scared. Well, no one's gonna be making that face here in this crowd today. Um, thank um, you. Life is beautiful. It's gonna be an amazing show tonight. We're excited mm-hmm. for your set. Um, but uh, as for music, you just released your video. All the good girls go to hell. Yeah. Um, whose idea, whose concept, visuals came up with the, the video? Me. All you. All 100% yeah. you. So what was, <laughs> at what point in time you're like, okay, I want to fall from, you know, heaven, the skies. I want to, wings to shoot out of my back. Um, you know what's funny about it is that the falling from the sky thing was just a visual I had in my mind. I actually, for, I like didn't realize that that's like what lucifer technically is and the thing is that the song is not about like the devil and the hell and it's literally like it's basically metaphors for like global warming and for climate change and stuff and i think if if you don't look into it you'll just think like it's about and hell and stuff but realistically it's about the world we're living in right now and um i just i just had this visual in my head of these like wings coming out since bury a friend and like all this stuff um and i just thought it'd be cool if i fell from the sky and fell into a f-ing pool of black shit. it looked great it looks so cool. i did yeah, thank you, you I did that you that. made it happen i did that and you know you did that and speaking of the global <laughs> the global climate strike <laughs> Uh, yeah. How did you get involved? Um, what's your message to others? How do people get involved? Um, I mean, I, I don't know if I even got involved. I just wanted, I just want to be involved. Um, I just think like it's there isn't that much time to be honest with you. And I feel like, do we want to die or do we want to live? You know, like do you want to live though? Like yes, right? We all right. want to live, yes. and we want you know our children to live and their children to live. And um, there's a lot of things you can do. I mean, for me, I. You know, I don't use a lot of plastic. I don't eat meat. I don't, um, you know, like I don't. I mean, there are some things that for my job I can't really do. You mm-hmm. know, I'd, I'd, I'd love to not have to waste resources on with like planes and cars and stuff. But, I, ha- you know, I have to get places. So right. there are certain things that you can like do instead when you actually can't help with some things. But there's like, you know, there's there's tech. There's like numbers you can text to protest and stuff. Um just like speak up, you know. You know, touring the world, uh, are the things that you've seen in, in other countries or just around the world, you're like, wow, we really need this. This is time. It's time to change. This is the time. Mm-hmm. Um, nothing specific. I think it's kind of everywhere. I mean, like, I, I don't know if there's one place that isn't struggling. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I think it, it doesn't matter which place is doing worse. I think we should all be trying to make it better. Well, I think it's great that you're using your platform uh, to. to get people to notice and to also take change and, and restore the climate because that's what we need to do or yeah, like yeah. you said we're all going to die right. yes die. <laughs> um, yeah. now on new music have you been working on anything new in the studio I I have you have I have um, nothing like I'm, I'm not like making an album right now I'm, I'm only saying that because <laughs> if I say that I'm working on new music I'll see some article that's like Billie Eilish is about to put out her second album which is so not true don't even have one well let's not talk about that I mean is there topics you want to talk about is there a different direction you want to go for just making if it's just making singles and dropping singles I mean I'm kind of just doing what I'm feeling right now I have like no uh, I have no lines at the moment. I'm just kind of making what I feel like it, and I don't have uh, a boundary. I don't have a. I don't have like a deadline. So it's kind of it makes it makes it feel a lot more fun, less like a job, and more just like what I I started out wanting to do. Right. 
as yeah. you should. You're your own artist. Do what I'm you want to do. Yeah. Do what you want to do. Um, you're also going to be coming up and performing on SNL at the end of the month. Yeah. Um, would, would you ever do some sketches? Was, would that be something you would get into that? Yo, people keep asking me. I would not. You would not? No, because that's... Sh- Listen. It's a little improv. No, I think <laughs> I think sometimes it's I think it's actually really funny a lot of the time, but I think it'd be corny as hell if I did that. Like I'm, I don't know. I'm what, what do you guys I, think? Would I you know I would see just I would just Billy rather watch improv? them be funny and I'll just watch them be funny and I'll just laugh. I don't uh, you know what I'm saying? Okay. All right. Well, we're going to watch you. You know it's SNL? like you you yeah. don't want to like people say like you don't want to see how your food is made. You mm-hmm. just want to eat it. <laughs> You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, I, I totally feel you. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good yes. Um, you're also performing at one of our shows, We Can Survive, uh, October 19th at oh, the yeah. Hollywood Bowl. Yes. Uh, your hometown. Have you performed at the Hollywood Bowl before? Um, not as me, but I used to be in a choir when I was little. No kidding. And we would do like shows with like the, with the, um, like, I don't like know. Like holiday stuff? The what? Yeah, the LA oh, Philharmonic. So I was like, like 12, like up on stage at the in Hollywood Bowl. Wow. Mm-hmm. And I mean, it was a peak live experience for me, and I was like, this is the only chance I'll ever get to do this. So, so it's cool to well, go there. Well, now you'll be back on stage. So it'll be now. the second time then that you'll be on stage at Weekend Like Survive. third time, which like third is time. so weird. But you can't even count those first two times. I was a little kid in a f-ing red sweater vest. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a popular venue. Is there an artist that you've seen there that you remember seeing growing up in, in Los Angeles? Uh... <laughs> I love you. <laughs> she hyping me up for nothing. This is cute. Um, I went there. I think one of the first times I went there, it was to see um, Dolly Parton, and I was like seven or something. And I ate I ate something bad before. Oh, oh, it was before I was vegan, so I ate dairy, and I got sick, and I was in the bathroom the entire time. Oh, wow. It was great. Not a good Dolly Parton incredible. experience. No, it was not. I'm sorry about that. Well, it's all good. It'll, be, it'll be better in October. It's all good. Um, what can we expect next for Billie Eilish tonight? Life is beautiful. What do you want to do? You're doing it on your own terms. Yeah. What's next? N- what's next in my life? Yeah. Woo. Hey, I don't know. Um, I'm, you know, I'm just trying to be... Be content with where I'm at right now mm-hmm. and where, you know, tomorrow, where I'll be tomorrow. I want to be happy with that. I'm like, I'm at this place right now where I'm trying not to, like, think about anything in the future, not think about the stuff in the past. I'm just, like, trying to live in exactly what I'm in because it's going to, like, go by in two seconds. And you are killing thank it. Thank you. Thank you. And you're still, I mean, you're killing it. You're still performing and, and you still have, you're, you're wearing your boot. Do you have your boot on? There it is. Wow. I have, most, two, most I have two. Both my ankles are sprained at the moment. And you're still getting both. up and performing, so nothing yeah. is stopping you. No. Do the doctors say when the boot can come off and you can get um, back to just being you? I have to. I've been wearing it 24 hours a day for the last two weeks, like in my bed, in the. F- that's. It's so weird to wear a boot in your covers, in your bed. It's so wrong. And when you have to clean it and shower and take I'm it okay off. I'm okay, though. I'm good. No, I'm good. Um, but on Sunday, which is like day after tomorrow, isn't it? It is, yes. Today's Friday. Yes, Sunday. Sunday, I don't have to wear the boot at night. Yeah. I do. No, I got to keep wearing it for the shows, though, because <laughs> they don't trust me and I don't trust myself. So um, I got to keep wearing it for shows for like a couple months, probably. But um, All right, we're going to see the yeah. boot tonight yes, on stage <laughs> at sure. Life is Beautiful. Thank you so much, Billie Eilish, for stopping by 97.1 Amp Radio.